What if I told you that you could create an entire animated story video with images, voiceover, and visuals almost automatically, without complex editing, without paid tools, and without advanced skills? Yes, today's video is going to completely change the way you think about AI video creation. Welcome to Vision Academy. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use AutoWhisk, the multi-version automator for Whisk AI, to turn a simple story into fully generated visuals, voiceover, and a complete video workflow. By the end of this tutorial, you'll know how to create cartoon 3D animation videos, story videos, or even YouTube content using free AI tools with minimal effort. Let's jump right in. First, open ChatGPT in your browser. If you're not logged in already, log in using your account. Once you're logged in, look at the left side menu and click on Apps. From there, click on GPTs. Now, in the search bar, type Free AI Story Generator. Click on it and then click on Start Chat. This GPT is designed specifically to help generate creative stories, which is exactly what we need. Now, in the chat box, type the prompt, Write a Cartoon 3D Animation Story in English for Kids. Hit the Generate button and let ChatGPT do its magic. Within a few seconds, you'll see a complete story written in simple English, perfect for kids, with clear scenes and storytelling flow. Now comes a very important part. We need image prompts for every single line of this script, because those prompts will be used to generate visuals. So now, ask ChatGPT to give you the prompts of each line of the script. You can either use this prompt alone, or you can combine it with the full story text to make sure ChatGPT does not skip any lines. This ensures every sentence gets its own visual prompt. Once ChatGPT generates the prompts, ask it one more thing. Tell ChatGPT to extract the prompts into a TXT file. Make sure you mention that you want prompts only in the same sequence without skipping anything. Once the prompts are displayed, simply copy all of them. Now let's move to the most powerful part of this workflow. Open a new tab and go to Google. Search exactly for AutoWhisk Multiversion Automator for Whisk AI. Make sure you type the name properly so you find the correct Chrome extension. In the search results, click on the official Chrome Web Store link. Now click on Add to Chrome. Confirm by clicking Add Extension. Once the extension is installed, you'll see its icon in the top right corner of your browser. Click on the AutoWhisk icon and then click on Go to AutoWhisk. You'll be asked to log in. Log in using your Gmail account. Once you're inside AutoWhisk, you'll notice a clean and powerful interface. At the top, you'll see a language drop-down. Select English. Below that, you'll see multiple versions available. From the list, choose version 7.6.0 API. This version works very well for consistent image generation. Now, paste all the image prompts you copied earlier from ChatGPT into the main input area. Scroll down a bit, you'll now see aspect ratio options. Choose Landscape 16x9, which is perfect for YouTube videos. If you're creating content for Instagram or TikTok, you could choose Portrait 9x16 or Square 1x1, but for this tutorial, we'll stick to 16x9. Next, choose the number of images to generate. You can select anywhere from 1 to 4 images per prompt. More images give you more options, but also take slightly longer time. Before clicking Start, click on Settings. Here, double-check that the language is set to English. Scroll down and make sure Auto Download is enabled. This is very important, because AutoWhisk will automatically download all generated images side-by-side, -side, saving you a lot of time. Once everything looks good, click on Start. Now, sit back and relax. AutoWhisk will automatically process each prompt, generate the images, and download them to your system. You don't need to manually save anything. This alone can save hours of work. Now that the visuals are being generated, let's move on to voiceover creation. Open a new tab and go to Google AI Studio.
on the home page, click on Turn Text into Audio with Gemini. This tool is free and unlimited, which makes it perfect for this workflow. Now select Single Speaker Audio. Paste the original story script generated from ChatGPT into the text box. Below, you'll find a variety of AI voices to choose from. Pick a voice that sounds natural and friendly, especially if your content is for kids. Once selected, click the Run button. Give it a few seconds. Now let's quickly check out the audio generated. Listen carefully to pronunciation, pacing, and clarity. In the colorful 3D town of Bubblewood, everything looked soft and shiny, like it was made of jelly and candy. Houses bounced gently, trees sparkled, and even the clouds smiled as they floated by. Living in Bubblewood was a small blue robot named Bebo. Bebo if you're happy with the audio, download it onto your computer. If not, you can change the voice and regenerate it until you're satisfied. Now let's go back to AutoWhisk. By this time, you'll notice that all the images have already been generated and downloaded. Everything is now ready. The visuals are ready, the voiceover's ready. Now it's time to assemble everything into a single video. For video editing, I'm using a completely free and open source software called Shotcut. Open Shotcut and create a new project. Import all the images generated by AutoWhisk. Import the audio file generated from Google AI Studio. Now place the audio on the timeline. Then start arranging the images on the video track, matching each image with the correct part of the narration. Adjust the duration of each image so it aligns smoothly with the voiceover. You can add simple transitions if you want, but even without them, the video will look clean and professional. Once everything is aligned properly, preview the video. Make sure the visuals match the narration and the pacing feels natural. In the colorful 3D town of Bubblewood, everything looked soft and shiny, like it was made of jelly and candy. Houses bounced gently, trees sparkled, and even the clouds smiled as they floated by. If everything looks good, export the video. Choose a YouTube-friendly resolution like 1080p. Wait for the export to finish. Now check out the final output. In the colorful 3D town of Bubblewood, everything looked soft and shiny, like it was made of jelly and candy. Houses bounced gently, trees sparkled, and even the clouds smiled as they floated by. Living in Bubblewood was a small blue robot named Bebo. Bebo had big glowing eyes, tiny wheels instead of feet, and one very special thing on his chest, a shiny red button. Beep, beep, don't press the button. Bebo always said, but one sunny morning, his best friend Luna the cat swished her rainbow tail and asked, Bebo, what happens if someone presses it? Bebo's eyes blinked fast. I, I don't know. Just then, boop, a curious green parrot named Pico had already pressed the button with his beak. Whoosh! The ground shook, music played, and suddenly Bubblewood began to float into the sky. Oh no, cried Luna. Beep, emergency mode, said Bebo. The town drifted higher and higher, passing fluffy clouds and waving airplanes. The friends had to work together fast. Luna used her sharp eyes to spot a giant balloon string tangled around. You've just created a complete AI-powered story video using ChatGPT, AutoWhisk, Google AI Studio, and free editing software. No paid subscriptions, no complex workflows, just smart use of AI tools. This method is perfect for YouTube creators, faceless channels, kids' story channels, educational content, and even storytelling reels. And the best part is, once you understand this workflow, you can repeat it again and again with different stories, different prompts, and different styles.
If you found this video helpful, make sure to like, share, and subscribe to Vision Academy. More powerful AI tutorials like this are coming very soon. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.